All right, well, let's see uh, what we've got going on here. Hello. Glad I got to use her today. My girl here. You really like that girl. What's not to like? Not much, I guess. Exactly. How do you run this place with just one cow? Used to have more. They get hungry too. Or sick. Got your doctor friend here now, though. You guys must trade for a lot of fuel to keep the generators running, right? People get hungry, and a few loaves of bread fetch a high price. Y'all are luckier on this side of the deal now. You guys are pretty out in the sticks here. Hard to find. You get many visitors? Not anymore. Bandits, of course. Used to get these school kids on tours back before the dead time. I'm gonna go wait for supper then. It'll be a good one. Yeah, that's a little creepy. I also, uh, just so you guys know, I turned down the volume two notches. It's on a one to ten scale. I turned it down to uh, six. It used to be at eight. I had a couple people saying they had a hard time hearing me, so let me know if it's a little better now. They're storing gasoline all over the property. Well, we're supposed to be just waiting for dinner. So I'm wondering if there's something that we're supposed to be doing in the meantime here. Well, they're in the barn, actually, taking care of that cow. Let's go check on them real quick. I know Clementine's out here in the barn. Sounds like there's a storm brewing. His reaction kind of scared me. He jumped back like he saw something. <laughs> it's okay, Clementine. You can pet her. It's okay. Go ahead. Whoa. Katya says Mabel could have her baby tonight. We'll see, Clementine. What's this thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. <laughs> Did you lick it? She's like, maybe. I don't know. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. We met this woman up in the woods. She seemed to know your brother. Uh, yeah, he, uh... He probably talks a little more than he ought to. Um, when do you think, uh, we might eat? Hungry, huh? <laughs> Don't worry. Mama's cooking up some good grub. How's the cow? Well, better now we got Doc on the case. Thanks. Yep. I don't know if I still trust these people or not. They act a little suspicious still to me. Salt lick. I got some storage boxes and stuff here. Empty. that 
Looks like a bunch of old dirty clothes. Ooh, smells pretty foul. Those look like the blood bags, the IV bags. Huh. It's a feeding trough. Okay, well thank you, Captain Obvious. Let's see what's out back. Oh, it's locked. You found it too, huh? Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff and something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. I got my whole family on this farm right now. How about you? What about Clem? I'll protect her no matter what. I know you will. Look, that guy with Katya, what's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal in those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. All right, Professor. What'd you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. Hey, Lee. You know how to pick a lock, right? No. Why would you say that? Well, because well, you're, uh... You know, <laughs> urban? Oh, you are not saying what I think you're saying. Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. <laughs> I saw that coming. Hmm. What? See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly, have a peek inside, and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. All right. Sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. Andy. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. Whatever. Can I help you boys find something? Just checking out the barn here. Never been to a dairy farm before. Just don't roam around without me or Danny. The farm can be a dangerous place. You know, the bandits and all. Sorry about your friend. Hey, uh, do me a favor. Don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. Uh-huh. Something's fishy going on here. Hey, guys, seriously, don't fuck around with that. Come on, enough already. Any thoughts on how to distract Andy? I don't know, man. Just look for something outside of the barn. We need him out of here. Okay. So, how does a woman like yourself run this whole place? Oh, look at oh, you. I manage just fine. Plus, I have my boys to help out. I couldn't do it without them. Okay, so... Hey, there's a plug right there. He's saying to find something outside to distract him, huh? We got the hay. Nothing we can interact with there. Can't interact with that faucet. Some more hay. Not seeing anything else out here. Looks like a feeding station for the cow. Not seeing anything yet. <laughs> 